Hi everyone! From now, we are going to introduce many things about Japan. This is Aryan from India. He will be going to elementary school in Japan from April this year. He is very excited for his first school experience in Japan. Nice to meet you. I'm Aryan. Like Aryan, for everyone who is going to school for the first time, we are going to introduce Japanese elementary school life to everyone. Are you ready, Aaron Kun? Yes! After Kyushoku, there is a 20 minute lunch break. However, they cannot rest carefree. In Japanese elementary schools, the kids will clean their own classrooms. First, they will put their chairs on their desk and move it to the back of the classroom. Then, they will break out into groups and decide the person in charge. They will clean the blackboard, classroom, hallways, and get a bako. The person in charge of the blackboard will clean the words written with chalk with their blackboard cleaner. Then they will clean the blackboard cleaner with a cleaner. They will wipe the blackboard with a dokin and dry it. Zoking is a cloth that you use when you clean up. You'll wipe down dirty places and make it clean. The person in charge of the brooms will take out the broom and dustpan from the cleaning tool case in the back of the classroom. First, they will broom the front of the classroom. The children use this classroom every day. So there are lots of garbage such as dust, eraser crumbs, and hair. Let's collect these neatly. After you collect them, you will pick it up with the dustpan and throw it out into the garbage can. Next, wipe down the floors with wet zoking. You need to be careful to squeeze the water from the zoking. If you do not squeeze enough, the class will be full of water and many kids might slip and fall. Now, Aryan, let's try! It is a zoking cleaning race with your friend Satoshi. You do not need to race the speed but make sure to clean the classroom. Wow, Aryan kun's white zokin is already so black. We can see that the classroom was very dirty. After you finish cleaning the front part of the classroom, you move the desk and chair forward and clean the back part of the classroom. The desks and chairs are very heavy, so everyone will cooperate with each other when moving it. By cleaning the school together with everyone, you will become more friendly with your classmates and also learn to use your places and things more carefully. During cleaning time, the teacher will not say anything and just watch. The kids will make rules on their own and clean up just by themselves. Move the desks and chairs back into the original place. 
For 35 kids, you will line the desk into two lines in the right, middle, and left. There will be a space between each line so that everyone can pass through. After you put the chairs down, you will clean the desks with a wet zokin. Wipe the desk that everyone uses to study and eat neatly. Wash the dokin clean and hang it up with a sentaku basami in the corner of the classroom. You will get the people in your house to make dokin from leftover towels. Every year, you bring two of them for the floor and for the desks to school. Today is finally finished. Lastly, everyone will greet each other and say goodbye. Zain kiritsu! Kyotsuke! Rei! Sayonara! Sayonara! Now, Arian-kun, can you come to school well again tomorrow? Be careful of cars and go home!